Good evening, my name is Jason Olive. I am 30 years old. Um, I am actually a master's student here at Liberty. I am in the MAP program for secondary education and I am focusing in English. Um, I am actually currently an eighth grade world history teacher, so I will be, um, I will be doing a little bit of a drastic change in education going from history to um, from history to English um, whenever I actually start teaching English next year. So um, I love it. It's the best job I've ever had before I was a teacher. Um, I served nine years in the military. I was a combat medic. Um, got my undergraduate from the University of Massachusetts in political science. So I have two children, I have a son and a daughter, um, eight years old and three years old. And the event that I would like to talk to you guys about um, that was life-changing for myself actually occurred just two days ago. The event um, was my brother two days ago decided to commit suicide. I was one of the first people to arrive um, at his house to find him um, before EMS got there. And needless to say, these past couple of days have been extremely difficult. I've had to witness my mother. Um, I, I've witnessed the changing of my mother completely in a matter of two days. What took a lifetime to construct the way that she presents herself now has been completely changed in over the course of 48 hours, give or take a few hours. And in those two days I can, I've already gained extensive knowledge as to why this would be such a life altering event for myself and it's because I now know the importance of what it means to close the loop on any shortcomings that you might have, whether it be with family members, whether it be with friends. If you may have disagreements with somebody or if you may not be as close to somebody that you used to, it is your responsibility to do everything in your your absolute power to make sure that if anything were to happen to that person that you could walk away knowing that you did absolutely everything in your power to make things right not cutting corners but actually trying to make things right for an example instead of texting your brother maybe you actually go over to their house Instead of saying, hey, I'd like to get, you know, get together, maybe make those reservations at that restaurant and say, hey, look, they're made. There's no excuse now. Close those loops because you never know when that loop that you could have closed might not have that opportunity anymore. So I beg of you guys moving forward that if you have some loops that, that may be off, I beg, I beg you guys to, to do the utmost in your power to make sure that you make things right. And maybe you can't, maybe you absolutely can't. Maybe somebody just not, does not reciprocate and that's fine. But at the end of the day, you'll know that you did what you could and you'll feel better for it. Thank you again. Until next time.